In this quick tip, I'm going to show you some changes that were introduced in 4.25 that has to do with the landscape mode. So in 4.24 or earlier, if you use the landscape mode, it was found inside the modes panel right here. And if you switch over, it would enable the landscape mode. The shortcut is Shift 3. And then you have your Manage tab, your Sculpt tab, and the Paint tab. And by switching to each tab, you'll have the tools available in the drop down menus here as well as for the brush type and the brush fall off. And then you can adjust the tool settings for each chosen tool. And you'll have the same thing when you switch over to the paint tab. And if you use the landscape mode, then you are very familiar with all the landscape tools and where they appear. However, since 4.25 and later, the landscape mode has changed where it appears within the editor but it still works exactly the same way. So all the tutorials that were done prior to 4.25 will still work. So in 4.25 or later, you will not find the landscape mode in the main toolbar right above the viewport underneath modes. Use the drop down menu and switch over to landscape. The new shortcut now is shift two. And also note that the shortcuts have changed for some of the other modes. Once you enable the landscape mode, the landscape mode panel will appear on the left hand side. And inside the perspective viewport is where you will find the three tabs for manage, sculpt and paint. And by switching to each tab right below it, you'll find the tools for that tab. So now instead of having a drop down menu like we did before, you'll find them right above the viewport. And by selecting each tool in the landscape panel is where you'll be able to adjust the tool settings and the brush settings for each selected tool. And if you need to find the brush type and the brush file off, you'll find them right here. And here I can select the brush type and the brush file off. And you'll have the same thing for the paint tab. So again, the landscape mode works exactly the same way is just where the landscape mode appears in the editor has been changed. And remember the new shortcut now is shift two and you can toggle the landscape mode on and off. Now, if you want to learn how to use the landscape mode and all of its tools, so you can begin sculpting landscapes as well as beginning to create materials and paint textures on your terrain. I have a tutorial course that will take you into everything you need to know on how to get started with using UE4 and the landscape mode. And I went through the entire course and I updated all the videos to include the references to 4.25 as well as 4.24 and earlier. And in addition, you will receive three important videos on how to use the new non-destructive landscape layers for sculpting and for painting that were introduced in 4.24. You can download this course by visiting worldoflevel.design.com or click on the link in the description box below the video.